Good evening, thank you for joining us. I'm Greg Glover. Cindy has the night off. Thanksgiving is one week away. As you prepare for dinner and travel, we want to help you avoid any crashes with a few safety tips for driving during deer mating season and to help both you and your pets stay happy and healthy through the holidays. A vet will explain what you may or may not want to share with them from your festive dinner table. We start with driving and wildlife. It's the time of year to take care and be looking out for deer as you head out and in, especially in the more rural areas. It's a shocking statistic. The Tennessee Highway Patrol reports more than 4,000 deer have been hit by vehicles across the state this year. It's resulted in more than 300 injuries and three deaths. Local 3's Jemiah Beatty has some tips to help you avoid hitting deer. Jemiah. Greg, I spoke to an Udawal resident who has already spotted a number of dead deer along a road in his neighborhood. Tennessee Highway Patrol reports deer rutting or mating season increases this time of year and more deer are likely to cross our ro roadways. Drivers beware. This time of year, the number of animal vehicle collisions are expected to ramp up. So when you're driving down any road, it's easy to spot a deer. Teddy Ladd from Udawal says he has seen a dozen dead deer in just this past week along Highway 58. I love deer, I love nature, and it really hurts me to see them, but we've moved into their living area. Ladd lives in an area where signs indicate deer frequently cross roads, and for this reason, he is extra cautious. We drive the speed limit, and we have the deer whistles on the hood of our car. Deer whistles are small devices on vehicles that emit noise in an attempt to warn animals of your approaching vehicle. Jim Hartley with River City Insurance says deer tend to travel in groups, so if you see one, assume there are more. He says knowing when they're active can also help you stay prepared. Early in the morning, late in the evening, at dusk, that's when they move around. And so you need to be aware when you're driving into work, driving home. Deer crossing signs are strategically placed in areas known for deer traffic. Triple A's advice to drivers is to be vigilant and scan the road so you have more time to react. Another good rule is to use your high beam headlights and try to avoid swerving. If you happen to hit a deer, pull over and report the incident to police. Lad wants to remind everyone passing through his neighborhood to please slow down and pay attention. Stay off your phones and watch where you're going. Now here's an interesting fact I found in my research. The Tennessee Wildlife Resource Agency says you can keep any wildlife you hit except for bears. So should you hit a deer and your vehicle is not too badly damaged, the good news could be the venison is yours. Learn more on our website in studio. Jamari Beatty, Local 3 News.